Hello, in this video we're going to look at how to create and edit content within an uh, uh, e-learning course that you have created using RISE 360. So we're going to use take one of my courses that is uh, basically based on this instructional design course and we're going to show how we're going to create content. Now each course that you create must have an overall goal of the course which you must state very clearly and you must have learning outcomes and for each one of those uh, lessons or modules, you would create specific learning outcomes and content. So we're going to take uh, one of these um, authoring learning programs. This is one of the lessons in this course, and I'm going to edit content. So I've clicked on edit. So he, once you click that, you're now within the lesson or module of your course. So here are some uh, uh, descriptions of the course, some images to make it aesthetically pleasing and here is one of the contents that has been added. So I'm going to show you how we do this. So this is a video. So in this, vid uh, this demonstration we show how to add video. So these are the blocks that are available. So that these are the various activities and resources that you can add to your module or lesson. So in any e-learning course, there are two things. There are either resources, which can be text, video, audio, or it can be activities. Activities can be giving, a, giving an assignment or doing multiple choice questions like a knowledge check. So now here we're just going to add a resource, which is a video. So we'll click video and it will give you a sample video. So we moved over here to edit and we're going to not use the sample video. We're going to replace this video with your own recording. I record using Peak, and this is the latest recording that I have done. So I'm going to open that, and it'll take a while. In the meantime, I'm just going to add a caption to that. Video of creating course using template in RISE 360. Uh, spelling checked and uh, it is processing the video. It will take a while. So when you're doing uploading, uh, it is strongly recommended that you hook your computer with a LAN cable at its faster. Second important thing to realize is when you're doing a lot of video creation, you must have a very high spec computer. Note a desktop powered by the power cable has a faster processor, even though it may be identical than that on a laptop running on a battery. Okay, so we'll wait for this video to be ready. And here we are, the, it has already taken up the video and it shows how to create a course using uh, video. So there you are. That is how you add a resource to RISE 360.